Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Dr. Tapati's presentation. Myself, Dr. Tapati Vanjade. Today in this video, I am going to discuss about cofactor, coenzyme, prosthetic group, apoenzyme and holoenzyme. This is unit 3 of the lecture series enzyme. In unit 1, I have given an introduction to enzymes, properties of enzymes and effect of different factors on enzyme activity. In unit 2, I have discussed about enzyme substrate interaction and history of enzyme. Links of unit 1 and 2 are provided in the description box. You can check that. Let's uh, start unit 3. Although some enzymes are solely protein in nature like pepsin and trypsin, uh, few enzymes need some help from non-protein component. Without binding with non-protein part, they can't carry out the reaction and they are inactive. Non-protein component of that enzyme is called cofactor. You can imagine, sometimes you feel like you can conquer the world with one hand when someone special is holding the other. Without that person, you feel you can't do anything. That someone special person is like cofactor. Protein part of the enzyme is called apoenzyme, which is a simple enzyme. And apoenzyme plus cofactor is called holoenzyme, this part. Apoenzyme plus cofactor is called holoenzyme, not this substrate, only the enzyme and uh, apoenzyme and cofactor. Both are called uh, hollow enzyme. It is uh, it is conjugated enzyme. So apo enzyme that means pro only the protein part of the enzyme is equal to hollow enzyme whole part of the enzyme minus cofactor. Cofactor may be an inorganic compound. Typically metal ions like calcium, magnesium, manganese. Uh, etc. Already I have discussed that, discussed that uh, they act as activators of enzymes. It may be loosely bound organic molecule which is called coenzyme and it may be tightly bound organic molecule which is called prosthetic group. Coenzyme plus apoenzyme is equal to holoenzyme. Inorganic molecules and coenzymes both are like your special friends, but they may leave you at any time. Bonds are not so strong. However, prosthetic group is like that special person who will never leave you alone. He or she will stay with you forever. External forces required to break the bonds. This table is showing some uh, inorganic metal ions as cofactor and their enzymes. Zinc is required for uh, carbonic anhydrase, alcohol dehydrogenase and carboxypeptidase. Calcium ion is required for alpha amylase. Copper ion is required for cytochrome oxide, oxidase. Uh, iron is required for catalase, peroxidase. Mag magnesium is required for hexokinase, glucose 6-phosphatase, pyruvate kinase, especially kinase enzymes. Uh, Mn2 plus manganese uh, ion is required for arginase, ribonucleotide reductase. Molybdenum is, uh, is required for dinitrogenase enzyme. Nick uh, nickel is required for urease enzyme and selenium is required for glutathione peroxidase. These are the important metal ions and they are enzymes required during the metabolic pathway. 
this table is showing different coenzymes and their enzymes which groups they transfer during the enzymatic reaction coenzyme a or coa is required by acetyl coa carboxylase for the acyl group transfer thiamine pyrophosphate that is uh, thiamine uh, or vitamin b1 aldehydes groups are transferred for uh, by pyruvate dehydrogenase complex peroxidox uh, pyridoxal phosphate pyridoxine that is uh, amino acid amino and other groups are uh, transferred by transaminase carboxylase and glycosin phosphorylase biotin is required for carboxyl group transfer by pyruvate carboxylase 5 prime deoxy adenosyl cobalamin is required for alkyl group transfer by methyl uh, malonyl mutase tetrahydrofolate is required for one carbon compounds uh, transfer by thymidylate synthase nicotine nicotine adenine dinucleotide that is nad plus derived from niacin is required for the electron or hydrogen atom transfer by lactate dehydrogenase enzyme whereas nicotine adenine dinucleotide phosphate that is nadp plus which uh, is derived from niacin uh, vitamin is required for again electron or hydrogen atom transfer and uh, it is used by glutamate dehydrogenase flavin adenine dinucleotide that is fad derived from riboflavin is required for same, same electron or hydrogen atom transfer by monoamine oxidase so we can understand why vitamin and different metal uh, ions are required as micronutrient because different metal ions are um, act as cofactor for different enzymes and uh, vitamins are the precursor for coenzymes which are required in biochemical pathway example of prosthetic group that means tightly bound with enzyme heme is a prosthetic group of catalase enzyme and peroxidase enzyme it is composed of ring like organic compound this this is the ring like organic compounds which is known as porphyrin to which an iron one iron atom is attached iron atom is attached with porphyrin that is called heme and it is required for catalase and peroxidase enzyme thank you very much for watching this video